Hello everyone! In this video, you will be made aware of various functions of management information system in detail. The prime objective of MIS set up by an organization is to obtain information to be used by its managers in decision making. Thus, MIS must perform the following functions in order to meet its objectives. Very first, data capturing. MIS captures data from various internal and external sources of an organization. Data capturing may be manual or through computer terminals. After data capturing, End users typically record data about transactions on some physical medium such as paper form or enter it directly into a computer system. Second, processing of data. The captured data is processed to convert it into the required management information. Processing of data is done by such activities as calculating, comparing, sorting, classifying, and summarizing. Storage of information is another aspect. After processing of data comes the storage of data. MIS stores processed or unprocessed data for future use. And if any information is not immediately required, it is saved as an organizational record. Even the data and information are retained in an organized manner for later use. The data that is stored is commonly organized into fields, records, files, and databases. Fourth aspect is retrieval of information. MIS retrieves information from its stores as and when required by various users. As per the requirements of the management users, the retrieved information is either disseminated as such or it is processed again to meet the exact demands. Dissemination of management information. Management information, which is a finished product of MIS, is disseminated to the users in the organization. It could be periodic, true reports, or online through computer terminals. By this, we end this lecture and hope you have understood the functions of management information system. Thank you.